today is New Year's Eve, which means new me, new, new year, new me. At least that's what I think 90% of the population does. And Cassie is no exception to that rule. You might be like, damn, who is that blonde bombshell? Mm. It's Cassie. I was just giving both of Salem and Cassie a makeover. I felt like, you know, since they're both almost adults, I think it's about time that they get like a different look. So Salem grew a beard, his hair is a little longer, he's wearing it loose for once. And messing around with Cassie, I definitely have found a style that works for her. It's amazing in very casual clothes. As you see, Cassie's rocking some slippers, a tank some pants that is Cass is just a very a very casual person and she never really bothered much with style and lately she's been experimenting a lot so I think she finally found what works for her which is um, a bit more revealing than what it used to be showing a little stomach showing a little you know arms that's something she never did but she's fully embraced her body for what it is and I feel like she's fully embraced that like just the woman that she is pretty much and I felt like she deserved a makeover that totally showed that off and the blonde eh, I was making you know giving her a, a, a makeover and then I looked at her and I was like like damn you look good and blonde and I was like why the heck not her concert is coming up in a couple days this could just be her alter ego. You know what? This could be Cassie's alter ego for all that I know about. Like, um, it looks like Cassie is bringing her coffee upstairs. She heard Salem wake up. And since this is New Year's Eve, I want to accomplish the New Year's Eve tradition as well as um, get some stuff done. So for New Year's Eve, we have to decorate, which we did. I'm going to just have her come over here and hopefully we can go ahead and make some resolutions for her. Ooh, okay. Cassie wants to get promoted, but I I feel like instead of focusing on work, she really wants to focus more on herself. So being fit, like we want to get fit. We once had that and like we want to get back into that body that we had. And right now, like we're not unhappy with who we are. We embrace the fact that we love food and we're just a little thicker than other people, right? But we definitely were a lot fitter and we want to be thick but fit, not, you know, weak and that's not like a good thing anyway uh fitness is something cassie wants to do for resolution workout equipment might be a good way to do this see the progress on the resolution of opening up the somology okay so oh ooh, okay that's all we have like seven days all right now for salem um i wonder like what would his resolution be right i think that salem um Salem has never really been one to really like work out and all of that. I don't know. I wonder what he wants. Oh, what would Salem want? That's a good one. I have to think about that for just a second. We're throwing a party and we're going to invite some people over. But since it's still early, I do want to get him, you know, get some things done. So why don't we get him into his new outfit? Oh my god, I love his outfit. It, it just screams Christmas, even though it's not. Like, and also I'm having this bug with, um, with the clothing i don't i don't know why or what but whatever <laughs> oh my god he's looking so good oh. salem is looking fantastic and look at betty but he's like sleeping on the thing anyway all right so um guys okay, so i want him to go out later today i don't i don't really have anything for him to do at this moment so i'm just gonna have him deal with whatever he uh, needs to deal with right uh so i guess he's gonna take a shower i took a shower she can pee excuse me you know what salem you could do you could go ahead and um unload and the dryness is still damp i guess we can do that anyway all right <laughs> mistake i need to um take care of my plants so that's one of the things i'm going to do we're going to super sell and then hopefully i can 10 garden and that should take care of that now i was thinking you know salem doesn't really have any friends as far as i know he doesn't really have any friends and he doesn't really have any resolutions either for this year. He doesn't really have much plans. All he knows is that he has a big heart for kids and for family and apparently really likes coffee too. And he's just he's just really just he's very introverted in a way. Uh he can be social, but he needs to, you know, to get out of his he needs to be pulled out of his um out of his shell, right? That's what he needs to do. He needs to be 
how do I put it? Like he needs to be dragged to a party to enjoy it, but he wouldn't just go just because you know he wants to. If that makes sense. Like, so like I said, Cassie has a lot going for her, but I feel like Salem, you know, he he, he like I said, he needs to be dragged out. So I feel like we should get him some friends, get him something he can do outside the house because he normally just stays at home and writes and everything. And I feel like Cassie is just encouraging him not to do that. Like Salem kind of overheard Cassie when she was thinking to herself, like, oh, I want to get fit. You know, Cassie sometimes talks to herself. That's just a habit that people who are alone have. Is that, a, is that a sentence? It's a habit that people who are alone have. Yes, that's a sentence. And um, Cassie, you know, Cassie and Salem are both kind of loners in a way. I think loners, but an introverted. They're not introverted. They're just loners. They are alone. They don't mind being alone, so they need to be dragged out. Though Cassie kind of got dragged out by her love for, you know, her newfound love for plants and exercise and her friends. Salem has not have that. And I think like he was overhearing Cassie. She was saying, I want to get fit. And I don't know, like... I need to get just a better version of myself and I think for that reason I'm gonna have um, like Salem get the same exact resolution I know it's kind of cliche but I think that he got inspired by Cassie's will to like be very fit and to get like in shape and and just her energy to just better herself is kind of driving him to better himself too and i wish there were more options to like to have a better mindset or to clear your thoughts or go for i don't know like go out more there's only like losing weight and you know getting fit and i feel like between the two getting fit would probably be better so for that reason uh we're going to pick the same one but technically he's not doing it because he wants to get fit he's just doing it because he wants to better himself i feel like that's day off holy guys <laughs> it doesn't happen very often so i want to go um I might just well start straight up right i'm just gonna go to the gym and get it done now like cassie managed to you know What's the word? <laughs> What's the word? It's like Cassie managed to convince them to go out, have a shot, like have some time with friends, try to start the new year in a in a, in a good foot or end the new end the old year in a good foot. I don't know. I guess we're entering and you know, going whatever. You know, <laughs> resolution complete. He just lifted one arm and he's like, damn, <laughs> I am a new person. Anyway, well I guess he's kind of like a new person. I need to take a picture of this. He looks too cute. We think like um, probably instead of working out, his mindset, his his his, um, his goal was more to um, hang out and do something out of his comfort zone, be a little bit of a different version of himself. And I think he did do that by going here and trying to have a workout, even though that's like totally not him. And he's he's hanging out with some of his friends. He has um. I know he's a bunch of friends, Jay Hunting Tun. Paolo is his best and closest friend, probably also because he knows him from Savannah. It's Savannah's, you know, fiance. I know, did I already mention that? I think I did. It'll be fun to kind of play around maybe with Savannah sometime because I feel like we've been focusing so much on Cassie and I feel like once perhaps her concert is over or in between our concert, I don't know, I might just kind of skip ahead. I don't know, we'll see. Um, but yeah, definitely not over here. You might still get to work on. I think he's kind of clueless, thinking like, what the heck am I supposed to do here? Like, um, like I don't know how to work out. I'm like sitting here, and I like I don't know. I, nothing's happening. Cassie needs to teach him a few uh, a few things. Looks like Cassie is reading a book currently um, about a Game of Groans. Well, it's better than a Game of Moans, right? Actually, that sounds pretty exciting. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm going to order some firework. I don't know if it actually has any use, like if it's going to matter um, for the results or anything, but I feel like we should get like a bunch. I mean, we have so much money anyway. So we have like five hours before the guests come. Um, so I want to cook a grand meal because I feel like that'll be nice to have fish dinner um you know what why don't we have a fish dinner my god my vegan heart just cries but it's a virtual fish so i can deal with that okay <laughs> hopefully <laughs> settle down heart definitely uh cassie's definitely running on some coffee lately i feel like uh coffee's become her new best friend looks like savannah has come early it looks like my excuse me it looks like my belly my, my prego belly is popping up again um but you know what we're just gonna ignore that guys we know how it is don't we excuse me don't sit down <laughs> Um, we actually need a TV to do the countdown 
So Mama's gonna have to purchase one just for uh, completing this because I don't have it. I just don't. Like these Sims do not care about TV. I get on with the dinner. Oh my God, Betty, stop being like that. Fish and all. And I can't really blame you for eating the fish, but come on, the wrapper's still on there. I don't exactly know how safe it is. Uh, <laughs> all right, we have a bunch of them, right? It just spread all around the house. There we go. <laughs> this should be fine. Everyone's getting a little tired, so we definitely need more coffee. Cassie has made a fish dish, which everyone can just grab a piece of if they want. She's also baking some cookies. He's brewing himself some more coffee because he's having troubles staying awake. And I feel like that's about everything we need for this party. All we need is to drink, dance, and play music, and he really seems to just ignore this tradition. It seems like Cassie is very much into this whole and New Year's Eve thing, but Salem just doesn't care. He's just really lazy and he'd rather not celebrate anything. It's too much effort. Kids, the kids are here. This is a very family friendly party. Maybe it'll be something different. Looks like Paolo is here, which is really, really nice. I am going to thank him for coming. I'm really, really, you know, happy that he's here. Um, and um, I feel like they can have a really good bromance going on. You know what I'm saying? I feel like they could definitely have that going on. Bring some food. Okay, Salem is getting himself more coffee. There it is, the last two minutes. Squammy script error. Please tell me. <laughs> script error. No, no, no. Get outside and I want to start lighting up these fireworks. I feel like that'll be really, really cool like to end the um, the new year. I feel like that end the new year, end the old year, end the year, whatever. <laughs> you know what I'm trying to say here. I think they'll be really kind of cool. I don't. Yeah, who doesn't like? Please. Oh no. <laughs> Salem. What have you done? Oh, Lilith, Lilith discovered the. Okay. Salem, please get out. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh no. Oh no. Don't wait. Get out of there. Why don't you tend the bar? Why don't we light up some fireworks? Oh, we, we're too late. Anyway. New Year's Eve was awesome. Cassie had a wonderful time and got to do everything he planned to. Great. We finally managed to do something and didn't feel at it. All right, let's go ahead and light these fireworks. I feel like Cassie will have a much better success doing this. Look at that. Isn't that cool? Isn't that cool? Nobody else cares about the fireworks, but I do. Was that it? That that was it. That was the firework. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> really really good i want her to um <laughs> now that we can let's just light all these fireworks even if nobody else cares i care and i like them so i'm gonna lit all of them okay okay i feel like this is the perfect perfect ending to the night absolutely amazing it looks like paolo and cassie are just enjoying the fireworks which is you know, i guess they have something in common they don't really have anything else in common uh besides that but it's nice to see them having a... It's nice to see everyone getting along. Um, but I think it's time to just wrap this part up because it's been way, way too long. She wants to be friendly with Salem, so I guess before uh, she goes to bed and all of that, we're just going to um, be a little friendly with them. At least for now, we have no worries, but the time will come. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!